What's the matter, brother? Somebody bad mouth Ernest Tubb or something? Worse. It's one thing to have some hairball run down Elvis. I mean, I'm just about shit sick of Elvis jokes. But to have him blow Reaper in my face while he's doing it. Let it go. Let it go. I know this one, Travis. It's a misdemeanor. Hairball won't do it anymore. Will you, Hairball? If it wasn't for fat old dad Elvis Presley, none of you would ever heard of Jimi Hendrix, or Peter and Gabriel, or Dove's Witness Shame, or whoever the hell it is that floats your boat. Thank you. Make me sick. One, two, a one, two, three, four. There's about 10 billion people who back me up on this. From the fistful post toe digger to the rocket scientist. Hell, I bet you can't find a preacher who don't like burning love. And your fans, a bunch of weak sisters, if they can't play, rip it up. Now every two-bit tabloid had bad things to say From New York City to La La Land While in his state he lay Well, if you don't think he paid for his sins Try paying for a few of your own Your serpent tongues can't reach him He's at peace in his heavenly home And if you don't think Elvis was the king, baby I feel sorry for you Cause if you don't think he was number one, you're full of number two. Well, hell, well, even the Beatles, who could rock it right through the roof, probably be the first ones to admit wasn't an Elvis in the groove. Yeah, even old Bob Dylan knows the words to Moody Blue. So if you don't think he's number one, you're full of number two. Yeah, if you don't think he was number one, then you're full of number two. If you don't think Elvis was the king, baby, I feel sorry for you. Pick up on it.